We're in the northern Bridgers, just north of Sacagawea. And on our skin up here, we dug a pit lower down. And that pit didn't give us any unstable results during stability tests. Up higher here, the wind has affected the slopes a little bit more. We have a little bit more of this kind of dense wind slab near the surface. That's kind of sitting on some lower density snow. We got an ECT to propagate uh, with fairly low force. And then we have uh, this new snow, old snow interface down near the ground. And that's given us some mixed results in stability tests. So it's just kind of your standard early season variable snowpack. And not all slopes are stable, not all slopes are unstable. So it's really worth doing your homework, just kind of assessing the snowpack before you jump into avalanche terrain. And with more snow and wind in the forecast over the next couple days, you're really going to want to look for these layers uh, while you're out skiing or riding.